Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Nakia. I'd love it if you'd consider subscribing. But today we are going to be doing a bit of a haul. So I've been doing a lot of shopping lately. Um, with it being July, there's been a lot of sales going on. Um, Nordstrom had their anniversary sale and just other people have kind of like followed suit and put a lot of things on sale so i've been doing a lot of shopping now in this video it's not going to be timely i think a lot of those sales are ending either today or tomorrow's or have already ended so sorry about that but just wanted to show you guys what i've been purchasing so i got a little bit of things from amazon um nordstrom uh h&m so i'll just show you guys some of the pieces and i'll also try to pop up a picture of what the items look like on the website if you guys are interested in seeing what they look like on me or seeing me style them just leave a comment below and let me know so the first thing that I bought was actually from Amazon and that is this to my right which is this jacket it is a I believe this is a suede jacket let me look it is by blank NYC and it's this kind of camel colored jacket I really do like it I want it it's a moto style suede jacket by blank NYC I'll pop up a picture of what it looked like on the model on the website but I really do like the color of this jacket and something like to transition into fall so this is the first thing that I've purchased and this came from Amazon I believe it was it's normally $198 um, it's a price I believe I saw on Blank NYC's website, but Amazon had it on sale. I believe it was like $118, 120 I'll try to put links in the description box below for you guys so you can click the link and go to it. I'm not sure if any of these things are still on sale though. So that is the first thing I got. So, oh, and there's one more thing I purchased from Amazon. And if you follow me on Instagram, you've seen these already which are these sunglasses so in my in my video i did about the um wish list i told you guys i wanted those sunglasses that um i forgot the girl that had it on in inventing anna so these are like a dupe of those glasses And again, I'll pop up a picture, but I really do like these glasses, these sunglasses. They do, they, um, they are like, a, the lenses are black, but they're kind of like a transition lenses. Like they fade a faded style lens, but I think they're really cute. I, I think I'm going to keep them. So we'll see how that goes. Okay, and I think that's everything from... I think that's everything from Amazon. So the next place I purchased some items from, I just wanted to get some basics and I got a couple of things from H&M and I also got one homeware item. So let me start with the homeware item. I got this vase from H&M. Just as like a decor item to put on my bookshelf. I really, it's textured. It's a little rough on the edges, but I thought this was really cute and I can put it on my bookshelf that's like right by my front door. So, got that. That's the only homeware thing I got from H&M. And then the rest are just like some basic tees. So, I got I got a black t-shirt. Again, just wanted some basics. Oh, and let me tell you guys the sizing on this. Um, this is in a size small, first of all. I'm not saying sizes going back. This is in a size small. Okay, so this t-shirt, I got just a basic black t-shirt. And this is in a size medium. I also got, I got it in white. Uh-oh. Okay, this is going back. There's a hole in this one. Yeah, this one has a hole in it. So this one's going back to H&M. Yeah, this is being returned, but hopefully you can kind of see that. Can y'all see the hole? Like, I don't know, but yeah, there's like two little holes in the front of the shirt. So I'm going to return that. 
Yeah. You're going back, sir. Or ma'am. Okay. But yeah, I like to have like some basic white and black t-shirts just to, you know, wear around the house, wear some leggings. And I figured with a black t-shirt, like this camel colored coat, I want to wear it with black. Like I think this would look cute with black jeans and a black shirt and maybe some black booties for fall. So I think that would go good together. Or even a black sweater would look good with that. Okay. I also purchased um, the white and black t-shirt that I just showed you guys. Those were purchased from the women's section on H&M. Again, if I can um, find the links, I will put them in the description box. And both of those were in a size medium. This is... Okay, this is the shirt I purchased actually from the men's section. And it's in a size small. It's a basic white t-shirt as well. So let's see. Hopefully this one doesn't have a hole in it. Okay, so this is a longer tee. It has like a little curved hem at the bottom. Hopefully you can see that. But yeah, this looks kind of long. I don't know. Maybe I should have got an extra small. Maybe I should have got an extra small on this. But is it me? Like, these t-shirts seem super thin. Like, I don't know. Like, thin, see-through thin. I've been trying to find a really good, like, basic white t-shirt that's thick enough where, like, I can't see through it. And just in the lighting, these look really thin. So, we'll see. Okay. And this, I just added, this is just like a basic white pink, or not white, a basic pink tank top. I figured I could use this and wear this to kind of like sleep in. Wear this with pajamas. And this is a size medium. So I figured this would be good to sleep in, you know, for pajamas because I don't know about you guys, but I'm a hot sleeper. Like I don't, I always see girls in those cute two piece pajama sets where it's like the long sleeves and it has like the white pipe or the white pajamas with like black piping or like a navy blue with white piping. And they look so cute in like the long pajamas, the long pants and the set just looks amazing. But for me, like I would die if I tried to sleep in that. So for me, I go for some kind of tank top, some kind of like boxer short, that's it. Like even sometimes that's a lot, but yeah, I can't be sleeping in a whole bunch of clothes, y'all. It's just too hot. But I figure this is thin, it's thin enough, it's short. I figure that's good. Oh, and I did go to, I did buy one thing from American Eagle. I bought some jeans, some white jeans. They had a sale too. Like everybody was putting stuff on sale, y'all. So I got these white mom jeans. They are um, destroyed denim jeans. Hopefully you can see that. Now the thing I do love about um, like when you shop online where people go online and actually like post pictures of how these items look on them. And a lot of people posted pictures of what these mom jeans look like on them. And the destroyed area of like the knee, it was different on everybody. And yeah, these holes kind of look big, but we'll see. We'll see. This is the back looks like. And I got these, I got it in a size four. Here's what the style is. And here is the tag. Hopefully you can see. It says it's normally $59.95. But yeah. So I got some white jeans. Like that was to go with the white shirts. Like I like to wear white on white. Don't be listening to people that say don't wear white after Labor Day. I plan on doing it. Okay, and last up is actually Nordstrom. I bought two things there. So the first thing I got is, um, I got this Barefoot Dreams cardigan. Hopefully you can see that. But I got it in black. I believe it was on sale for, oh, let me look at my receipt. They didn't put the pack, they didn't 
didn't put the price on here. Okay. I don't know what the price was. I thought it was like a, a, or $80. I think it was $79.90 or something like that. But they don't have the price on here, on the on my receipt. Sorry, y'all. I'll look it up. But it might not be on sale anymore anyways. But, oh, here it is. Duh. All right. It's on sale for $79.90. And it's the Barefoot Dreams cardigan. And I got it in black. I've, this is very soft, y'all. I've always wanted this blanket. And every time people post their anniversary sale videos, I'm like, I'm going to buy it. I'm going to buy it. I'm going to buy it. And I never buy it. And I have a black like pullover sweater that I'm not even going to show you guys because it's so beat up. There's holes in it, but it's so soft and comfy. Like I don't want to throw it away. So I figured, let me go ahead and just buy it, buy this Barefoot Dreams cardigan so that I could, you know, at least just be comfy in the fall time. Oh my gosh. Oh, it feels so good. Ugh. Okay, but it's not fall. It's it's hot right now, so I probably need to take this off. But yes, love this. This, a white tank or a white t-shirt, some black leggings. Like this is going to be my work from home uniform during the fall and winter time. So get ready to see this a whole bunch. Okay, and lastly, I got from Nordstrom for the anniversary sale. It's a, I guess this is like a beauty item. I got a T3 curling iron. So yes, I got a T3 curling iron. They only had it left in the color black. They had that in stock when I was able to st um, shop the sale. Okay, so this is what it looks like in the box. So, a little story. I've been using Hot Tools curling irons for a while and I love them. And the one that I have is like a titanium and it has like a pink handle. You may have seen it in a video or on Instagram before, but I love that curling iron, but it's it's so old, it's, it gotta be over 10 years old. And it's the like, there's a short in the wire. So you know how you have to hold the cord a certain way for it to actually turn on, like stay on? That's where I'm at with that curling iron right now. So I needed another one to replace it. And I knew this like a couple years ago before it got this worse. And I've been buying other Hot Tools curl irons, but they do not get as hot. Like, I don't know what's going on. Like they don't get hot. They don't, my hair doesn't hold it. Like it won't even really curl with these curling irons. I got one that's like white with the black barrel. I have one from their gold series. And those two curling irons are like trash. Like I do not recommend them. But I figured I will go ahead and invest and get one of these. I believe this was on sale for like 113, 114, something like that. So it better be good, especially with all the hype that I see about it online with other YouTubers. So I'm going to try it out, see if I like it, see if my hair holds a curl. I could, I, you know, what? I may actually do a video showing you guys like first impressions and doing like a mini review on it and see if I like it. But yeah, I'm still trying to use that um, Hot Tools curling iron, that pink one. So maybe I'll do a comparison and see if this is better. Or I hope it is. For $113, I hope it's good. But um, okay, so I have one more item. That's a clothing item that I picked up from Saks Fifth Avenue I, or Saks Offset. I purchased it on their website. Um, maybe like three, four weeks ago because they had it on sale. But it's this Rails plaid shirt. And I got it in a size medium. I've already worn this once and I really like it. And I love Rails plaid um, shirts. I already have, I have two other ones. They're really good quality shirts. And I love to wear them year round, even though a lot of people wear plaid just in fall. I wear them year round. Like I have a blue one. Um, I wore in a video. Love that one. But yeah, this is it. Yeah. So that is it for the video, guys. If you enjoyed this video, please do not forget to give it a thumbs up. If you're new here, please consider subscribing and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.